Welcome back to another episode of The Daily Threat, your go-to source for the latest in cybersecurity news. Today we have some jaw-dropping stories that highlight the ever-evolving landscape of cyber threats. Before we dive into the details, a quick reminder to subscribe to The Daily Threat to stay informed and protected. Today's episode is brought to you by QIT Solutions, your trusted partner in cybersecurity. Our first story comes from the Hacker News, and it's a chilling reminder of the sophistication of cyber criminals. A new threat has emerged known as Scam as a Service. Yes, you heard it right, a service that provides cyber criminals with the tools and infrastructure needed to carry out scams. The dark web marketplace Discovered is offering a range of services, including phishing campaigns, social engineering, and even ransomware as a service. This means attackers can now simply buy into a criminal enterprise, making it easier than ever for even novice hackers to launch sophisticated attacks. To understand the gravity of this threat, let's break down how it works. The marketplace offers ready-made scam packages, complete with phishing websites, fake emails, and even call scripts. The attackers can customize these packages based on their targets, making it harder for traditional security measures to detect and prevent these scams. The payment model is also alarming. Hackers can choose to pay a percentage of the profits they make from successful scams, creating a business model that incentivizes more attacks. Now, for our viewers, it's crucial to stay vigilant. Ensure that your organization has robust email security solutions in place, conduct regular employee training on recognizing phishing attempts, and consider implementing multi-factor authentication to add an extra layer of defense against compromised credentials. Next up, a report from Bleeping Computer reveals a malware strain that's making clever use of Google OAuth endpoints to revive cookies and hijack accounts. This is a significant development as it leverages legitimate Google services to carry out malicious activities. The attackers are exploiting Google's OAuth authentication system, which is designed to grant third-party applications limited access to a user's account without exposing login credentials. The malware abuses this process to silently retrieve access tokens, essentially reviving expired cookies. This technique allows the attackers to gain unauthorized access to user accounts without alerting the victims or triggering traditional security measures. To defend against this type of attack, organizations should regularly audit and monitor third-party applications that have access to their users' accounts. Additionally, implement anomaly detection systems that can identify unusual account activity and educate users about the risks of granting unnecessary permissions to third-party apps. Our final story takes us into the healthcare sector, where hospitals are grappling with a serious data breach. Cloud storage is meant to be a secure solution, but unfortunately, this incident highlights the vulnerabilities that can arise when relying on external services. Several hospitals have taken the drastic step of approaching courts to compel a cloud storage firm to return stolen data. The breach not only raises questions about the security of cloud storage services, but also the potential impact on patient confidentiality. The attackers gained unauthorized access to the cloud storage, exfiltrating sensitive patient data and putting countless individuals at risk of identity theft and other cyber crimes. In light of this incident, organizations, especially those handling sensitive data like healthcare institutions, must conduct thorough due diligence before entrusting their data to a third-party cloud storage provider. Implement encryption for data both in transit and at rest, regularly audit access logs, and have contingency plans in place for the quick response to potential breaches. As we wrap up today's episode, we've seen the variety and complexity of cyber threats continue to evolve. Remember, cybersecurity is a shared responsibility, and staying informed is your first line of defense. Subscribe to The Daily Threat for regular updates on the latest cyber threats and best practices to keep your digital world secure. And, of course, a big thank you to our sponsor, QIT Solutions, for making this show possible. Until next time, stay safe and stay secure.